Hi, here we have a patient, 23 years old female. She presented with a painless, slowly progressive swelling left upper lateral for the past 3 months. In clinical examination, a firm swelling of size around 3 to 2 cm lies just below the angle of mandible and anterior to the sternocleidomastoid muscle. After that, we did a screening ultrasound of the swelling and you can see that it is a cystic swelling uh, with a few echogenic particles in it and you can also notice that the swelling is in close relation with the major vessels of the neck that is inner jugular vein and the carotid artery. After that we did an MRI for this patient and you can see the images. Then we decided to operate and remove the cyst. And uh, here are some landmarks. Sternocleidomastoid muscle, the cyst and uh, upper skin crease is used for the incision. Skin is incised and deepened. A subplatysmal flap is developed. The cyst is mobilized all around and here is the final attachment. The aspirate of the cyst showed a yellow colored fluid maybe because of early infection. Here is another young lady who also presented with a right sided neck swelling. Unlike the previous case, here the cyst is quite large containing the entire lateral neck. In this case also we marked the cyst and operated it. Here you can see large cyst which containing straw colored almost clear fluid and you can also notice that the cyst is in close relation with the internal jugular vein.